Hi folks, I hope everybody's doing good today. Uh, say hi to Rodney and Bill. We'll fix this up over here. Um, <clears throat> got a quick video for you. It's a little fixed blade, a Schrade 1540 old timer. Um, something I'll probably be strapping on my hip this winter as a carry piece. But I'll give you a quick look at that. Let's do a quick update. Ian and Larry, I did, wasn't able to get to the post office today. I had to go get some tires put on the mom van. Uh, I had two tires that had slow leaks. And we're going to be getting some snow around here pretty soon, I imagine, with um, you know this late in the season. So I want to make sure that was all safe to drive in. I got tired of putting air in the tire because it hurts when I bend over because of the tubes in my abdomen. Although the one in the chest got removed. But anyway, um, so yeah, this is what you want to look for. This is pretty cool. I'm repurposing this box. This is the one that my good knife in Helsinki, Finland, um sent me that I bought from it from them so this box came from Finland over the pond to here now I'm sending it back over the pond to the UK for Ian so that's the box you want to look for um, of course it'll have a label on it I haven't got to that part yet but these will go out tomorrow this one in the Remington for Larry and it just so happens that <clears throat> my rough rider came today the hippo toe uh i bought the one to give away but then i liked it so much because it kind of fit in my collection like right here so i had to get one for myself let's see what this looks like Of course, I took a peek at it to make sure it was cool. And there she blows. Exactly like Ian's. Nothing wrong with it. So, let's put this back right in there. And there's the Hippo Toe collection. Now, let's get on to... The Schrade 1540 Old Timer. Get that baby. This is a USA version. I think they still make one um, from China. And these here, for some reason, it's not because the blade's been sharpened, but it's just the way they design it. You got your little... Um, um, finger stop here little guard but you'll see it's, it's lagged right out anyway so that's a, kind of a little bit dangerous there but a really high quality sheath nonetheless and there it is you guys probably seen a lot of these in the sharp finger version with the uh, Persian blade this here is the drop point version. And let's move on up here. Three and a half inch blade. With the three inch cutting edge. Although if you look on these, you'll see how thick the blade is before it starts to get sharp and that would be all the way up here right up about here which is kind of weird you would think that they would grind down to here but there's still plenty of blade to cut on and it looks like it's pretty good for piercing as far as aging these things or dating them I have no idea. And this is a user. 
an abuser. I forgot what I paid, somewhere around 60, I think. But it is the USA, Trade USA 1540T. And we know it's not older than the 1960 or prior uh, to 1960 because it's an old timer with the uh, Delrin covers. which are hand-hafted, by the way, as you'll see. It's not very uniform, which I like. Shows some handcraft craftsmanship. So, if the sheath wasn't so sketchy, I would carry this more. But I'm definitely going to carry it a few times this winter um, only because you wear so many you know different style pants and jackets you got pockets for everything so but ain't that cool I mean it's in great condition look at that handle looks almost brand new on both sides I don't like this lanyard. It's um, a thicker leather strap. And I like to put the twist on there, but it's not staying. I can't train it. Eh, maybe. I'll get it wet. <coughs> Man, <clears throat> I'll get it wet again and see what happens. Blade has a little bit of um, spotting going on. But I'm not even going to mess with it. I'm just going to has a good edge on it decent edge it probably won't cut paper because I don't think it's that sharp but um, yeah I can sit here tonight and put a better edge on it definitely needs more more work but there it is, the Old Timer 154, USA version, slightly used and ready to abuse. So I hope everyone had a great day today. Take care. And until next time, my friends, take care. Peace. Bye-bye.